Aquarius, hi. Um, this is your weekend tarot reading. It's divinely timed. It's for anyone with Aquarius in their chart. And um, thanks for subscribing. Thanks for giving the video a thumbs up. So I've got some information. It all depends on what cards come out. <laughs> but I may dip into some written information because I've got I've got information to hand to make the readings even better. <laughs> and I, some of it's gone up here, but not all of it. So I may use the information that I've got if that's okay. And um, anyway, so we'll ask Spirit what's going on for Aquarius at the weekend. And we'll just see what Spirit says. For Aquarius. Okay, my beloveds. We had this come out for the twin flame reading yesterday. My beloved, though we may be physically apart, spiritually we are always united. Love transcends space and time and nothing is missing. I know with Aquarius you're a very free-spirited and independent star sign, but you are also very sentimental and deeply caring. Um, there's a link there with somebody that is just so deep and beautiful. Even if you don't see each other, that connection doesn't really dis dissipate. If anything, it probably just stays stronger, <laughs> grows stronger. So, okay, let's see what else we're getting here. Okay, there's a very spiritual healing energy going on here for Aquarius at the moment. You see, that is really spiritually healing it's a gorgeous energy um i don't know if it's for you or somebody connected to you but there is very deep spiritual healing going on okay let's go deeper So Queen of Swords, Ten of Cups, Star. Um, with the Queen of Swords, Aquarius, you have had to stand your ground. And it, it has been about you becoming much more resilient, much more um, in your power. Very independent, um, just very self-sufficient and more self-assured. So it is about you learning to come into your power and that's what's been happening. And some people may have found that quite harsh to deal with or surprising to see you like that. I don't know, but it is what it is. For some of you, a relationship at this current time isn't really what you need. <laughs> it's been more about you finding out who you are and embracing your power and you know, that's that's my journey. <laughs> That's where I am right now. So uh, it's like the ego wants that attachment to somebody or to a relationship. But actually, it's just such a more beneficial journey to learn to be self-sufficient, isn't it? And at the end of the day, we'll get much more from that longer term. Uh, and then actually the relationship may come. Ten of Cups. <laughs> This is celebrating. This is celebrating because some good news is coming in. Um, something very positive happening here for you at the weekend. Uh, feeling very, very happy. Um, you could be celebrating just because you've kind of found yourself. <laughs> uh, but you could be celebrating anything, really. Um, this healing that's going on. Um, also, there could be here a relationship because, you know, we're moving into star energy for Aquarius here as well. This is a yes from the tarot. You must keep believing and you will, actually. I don't think I even need to encourage you to do this. You are in such alignment here to get these cards. Um, and it's all because you've just learnt to stand in your own power, your own frame and connect into yourself and into spirit. And you, around the weekend, you're going to start really reaping the rewards of this, you know. Emotionally satisfying relationship here. You've got the card, my beloved. You know, something being healed, somebody being healed. And the star card, the stars are aligned. This is all predestined. So yes from the tarot. 
uh, whatever you have been wanting to manifest is within your the realms and reach of you. Um, something amazing will be happening this weekend. Okay. Um, let's see what's going on for your person then. Oh, Queen of Wands. Somebody wants to offer you something. And it could be a feminine, but it doesn't have to be. It doesn't have to be a woman. Okay. It's somebody that, you know, does well sort of career-wise. Or, you know, they're just... There's something very attractive about this person. They have very attractive qualities and they really want to offer you something. I really do feel for a lot of you, this is going to be an improvement in a relationship. A relationship being healed, I feel. Um, let's see. What was this person thinking then? Hmm. I need to have more fun. There's a lot of yellow energy here. Uh, it feels very bright. It feels very sunny. It feels like a new beginning. It feels like the more present you are, the more wonderful things are going to start manifesting and happening for you and somebody else. Um, your spirit guides stay optimistic. Your dreams are coming true. Don't quit right before the miracle occurs. There could be a miracle healing for somebody. Um, there could be miracle healing for a relationship. Uh, it's all predestined. There is something amazing happening here for Aquarius. Okay, so enjoy. If you want a more specific reading for yourself, one-to-one, -one, just contact me. Thanks for subscribing. Thanks for giving the video a thumbs up as well to help it get out across YouTube. And I am sending you lots of love, lots of peace wherever you are on Gaia.